And the answer is what you want to have in the art station is for you to impress somebody who is already professional. You want to, you want to um, go in and it sounds lame, but like you want to go to a forum and say, look, is this, is this on par with what's out there? No, if not, what do I need to do to make it like, you know, at what point is this going to look like studio quality concept art, you know, and um, what we as a studio want to want to see isn't just that you can draw well, it's that like you can draw well and it looks like you could hit the ground running, you know, like it looks like research the studio that you're going to apply to basically find out what they're doing. What is their, what, what are their concept artists produced? Look at their work, match their work, then show it to them. You know what I mean? But, you know, obviously put your own spin on it. Um, and then it's better to have one piece that's awesome, like this girl's, than to have 10 pieces that are mediocre. Like, it's ter don't, don't, even have, don't even have 10 pieces in there with nine of them that are mediocre, or eight of them, or two of them. Just throw out the mediocre. Never have it. Always have your best stuff. Thanks for listening to this clip. You can see the full interview by clicking the link in the description, or you can click the thumbnail on the bottom left of this video. And don't forget to hit subscribe. Have a great day.